Hello there, in this video, I'm going to teach you how you can create your own Tumblr apps or Tumblr app designs you can sell on Etsy using Leonardo AI. First of all, head over to ChatGPT and generate some prompts that you're going to use. We're just going to select any one of these. Keep in mind with the AI PRM plugin, you can generate prompts with the actual negative prompts too. Just paste in your normal prompt, turn on the negative prompt, and then paste in the negative one. After that, just hit generate. Wait for it to create your result. If you like this, you can continue or we're going to try another one. If you're not getting any good results, make sure you turn on the link and make sure your prop magic feature is on. We're going to try again. Just wait for it to create your image. After that's done, just select any of these. Save it. And head over to Pixelbin. Over here, upload the image that you want to use. Go over to their upscale feature. Select the file. Hit the enhance quality button and change it to 4x and hit start. After it's upscale, just download the image. After it's done downloading, you're going to head over to this website. Over here, you're going to open a new project and make the width and the height. After that, you're just going to hit create. And over here, you're going to drag and drop your image. Make sure you drag and drop the upscaled one. Just make sure your image fits in frame. And after that, you're going to just save the image. After that, you're just going to download a Tumblr app template from anywhere. You can find it on its Etsy and purchase it. Over here, you're just going to upload the image of the Tumblr app template. Just drag and drop the image of the template. And after that, just paste your image above it. After pasting it, you're going to just change up the opacity of the image so you can see through it. Just enough that you can see through. After changing the opacity down, you're going to go to Edit, Transform, and then select Warp. After that, just grab one of the corners and align it with this corner. Just make sure you fit this image. Warp it as you see fit.
And after that's done, you're just going to change the opacity of the image again. And now you have your Doubler app image, which you can use. After this, you're just going to download the image. And then you can use it by uploading it to Etsy or any digital store. That sums up the video. Thank you for watching and goodbye.